Hey, what's up guys? Johnny here, back with more Shadowgun Legends. In today's video, I'm gonna use the new AT Blockbuster Auto Rifle. It's the one from the new PvP event. I decided to keep the one from uh, a couple days ago with 10% damage and uh, damage to Elite. It's got Iron Sight and Accuracy. Uh, some guys sold that one. You get one with a little less damage and uh, crit damage instead of Elite, I think. I don't remember exactly the perks. But anyways, I played with that rifle a little bit in the arena, and I think it's not that bad at all. Some guys don't like it. It's not very accurate, honestly. It seems to be shooting, especially from long range, uh, left and right of your target. Uh, but we'll see how good it is for hive mind, maybe. Some guys say it's important to have lots of ammo for hive mind and decent damage on your rifle. The whole point is trying to kill uh, the clusters with one single clip without having to reload but we'll see how well this thing does in hive mind let's do this guys all right we got a game yoni and carnage op on. i don't know if it's carnage op or carnage op but some random guys on my friend list uh let's go so he, he's there two two guys from the same squad i don't like to say guys but yoni is a cool guy <laughs> yoni i'm trolling I know you need a girl. Anyways, cool story today, guys. On the Facebook. Best topic ever. Uh, I don't know if I, if I should do that. Um, but it's been reported there's a there's a bug in Hive Mind. If you guys don't know, it's been out for a while. Um, they say I think it's Dub uh, from ESR. He reported that on Facebook. He said if someone drops a um, healing, uh, healing kit, is that the name? Uh, and you stand on it and you reload a couple times or something, uh, you might trigger a double damage bug. But, oh my god. Yeah, it seems like I'm doing a lot of damage right now. 372 or something. That's a lot of damage. So that doesn't count because I'm doing uh, the double damage, definitely. On my last Hive Mind video, um, some guy said, Yo, Johnny, it's the crit damage that's activated. You should know that. You've been playing it long enough. You should know it's crit damage. Crit damage numbers are yellow, usually. And uh, it's not crit, guys. You don't crit the, the cluster and the data hives. I haven't played Hive in a while, by the way. Look at the damage. But this is... Uh, normal numbers, but I'm actually still doing double damage. The double damage glitch or bug or whatever you call it, um, it's pretty OP. It really helps clearing hive mind faster. It's, it's not what I was gonna say, and uh, the video right now is not gonna show what I wanted to show because I got double damage glitch, and I'm gonna keep it for the like probably for the rest of the the run. Because once you have it, once you know you have it, uh, it's not gonna show when you deal damage to enemies, but you're still doing the double damage. And you will see when I uh, shoot the cluster, like right here, check the damage, it's still there. So it doesn't show when you shoot enemies, but it's still you're still doing the damage. So because of that, uh, I cannot really show how good the, the rifle is on the regular clusters. But it doesn't matter. I'm still gonna do this run. It's gonna be a good run, and uh, it's still gonna be fun. But hot topic on Facebook is not even about that. It just happened to happen at the same time I was uh, talking about it uh, earlier today, which is yesterday if you're watching this video. But conspiracy theories, guys. It's uh, I don't even know if it's trolling or if it's for real. But the new hot topic, guys, apparently, uh, if I walk on that, I lose my double damage. I hope I didn't touch it. So, yeah, apparently, guys, if you spend money in the game, it increases your drop rates for legendaries and epics. So, it's the number one tip for new players. Uh, before you, like, first thing, level up to max, 20 plus 5. And when you're ready to farm dungeons, spend money in the game. Because it's going to increase your drop rates. And uh, I know I should not make fun of the, the topic, the post. But I cannot not laugh at that. Like, it just shows like people, and I want to be respectful, of course, but 
People who don't understand maths and random numbers and statistics and probabilities, they come out with all kinds of ridiculous shit. And yeah, I have to say it's ridiculous. Anything. And then some guys... I, I say you should not spread false information because it's not true and it's been confirmed not true. Like spending money will not increase your chance. It, it does not change the drop rates. Drop rates are there, it's random, and nothing you can do except increasing your loot percentage will increase your drop rates a little bit, but... Like, I'm speechless right now. And then some guys say, you so, so true, and they will not tell us, but it's true. Yo, if, I, if, if, if that was true, they would. Because people will spend more money, yeah, you know, they would not hide it. Come on, man. But then some guys confirmed, it's like, yeah, that's right. I did like 500 runs and I got almost no legendaries. And then I spend money and then boom, on my next run, I magically got a legendary. What, mate? So the other guy says, yo, you just confirmed my point 100%. That is so true, and I don't know what to say at that point, but I was not, you know, working so hard to get the right stuff out there so people have all the right information, and I always get mad a little bit when people say, like, Mother's Promise drops and uh, Bronze or uh, uh, Nico drops and Hive or whatever, you know, and when someone post something that is not true it it gets to me a little bit because then people will read that and they will spread it and say it like my friend told me he got Nico in Hive and then someone else says yo I know a guy and his friend got Nico in Hive so and then some guys come to the discord yo is that true that is that true that Nico drops in Hive mine now so it really sucks but that did, that's something else, you know, like, come on. And then is that true that uh, spending money increase your drop rates? And then some guy's like, yeah, that's true. I know a guy, he spent money. But you know, and then some guys say, it's a fact. You cannot argue with that. It's a fact. It's, we got proof. And then when we don't, like when we say you're wrong, bro, I'm sorry, but you're thing doesn't make sense it's, and they say what you got proof yo oh, man come on dude this some um, randomness you cannot prove either way it's, it's it is bugging me and then and then people say he has the right to his opinion of course everyone has the right to an opinion but it's not about opinions at this point you're, you're giving tips to people and what you're telling them is is just wrong. It's not true. So uh, that was the the hot topic today, and I made the mistake again of getting involved. I I feed the troll, and I, at this point, it's maybe fifty percent chance this guy is just freaking trolling. You know, trolling the Facebook, and people are getting into it you know I don't know where to go now so I made the mistake of getting involved in that stupid topic and then people give me shit like what the hell Johnny the guy has the right to his opinion of course man but it's not this doesn't make sense let's see how fast we kill this boss now I need to drop ammo that's my main Thing here when we get the double damage if you don't want to lose it you cannot switch weapons you cannot aim down sight so if I run out of ammo uh, I will probably lose my dub double damage because it will switch weapons so trying to kill the, the ads and hopefully they will drop ammo and they do that is very good but I'm uh, slowing my team down because I'm not killing my data hive. Let's go. So final stage already. It's gonna be a fast, fast run. 
and then let's see the accuracy like you see right it's pretty easy to see the the bullets trajectory i don't know how good you see but at least one i can tell it went the i missed the target i should have shot the far away cluster so you guys could see but yeah, that weapon is not bad at all. And some guys wondering why I don't use my supercharger right now. Because you don't see, but I'm still doing double damage. And if I use a uh, supercharger, I'm gonna lose it. And that's gonna be it, guys. Not running out of ammo this run. So I don't know how you like the, the weapon. Because that was the <laughs> first uh, point of this video. But it turned out to be uh, about double damage bug. But let me know in the comment. Wow, 1008. What, what version did you keep? Two snipers. I got a couple chests, by the way, guys. So we're gonna relog for sure. See if we get good stuff. Let's drop one of these snipers. So three chest piece, guys. And it's uh, 249. And you guys know what? Uh, Caterpillar set, my favorite set. In the whole game all right back after relogging let's see the perks now this is the first one so not so good one hp perk and a couple auto heal boost now the caterpillar please ah uh, it's three auto heal perks one purple two green and the last one is okay one blue hp and two auto heal so nothing great guys but it was still a super cool run great time 1008 so thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed the video leave me a comment below how you like the new ar from the pvp event well, let me know if you got a good one with good perks don't forget to hit the like subscribe to the channel and i'll be back soon take care